Bishop Connolly High School in Fall River, Massachusetts, where tonight Fall River Community Media is proud to bring you coverage of the National Junior College Athletic Association's 2014 Men's College Basketball Tournament. Here in Region 21, Division 3, it's a first round match between the homestanding Bristol Bees and the number five num Northern Essex Community College Knights. Ethan Lopez with you high above the court here at Bishop Connolly High School. The Bristol Bees coming as the number four seed in this six team Region 21 New England bracket. A record of 17 and 10. They are actually coming off a win in the Massachusetts, Kamal, Massachusetts Community College Athletic Conference's championship game, actually defeating this night's team from Northern Essex out of Lawrence, Massachusetts by a score of 75 to 60. Again, the Bristol Bees out of Bristol Community College here in Fall River come in with a record of 17 and 10. The Knights of Northern Essex Community College out of Lawrence with a record of 14 and 15. Sardis for the visitors being introduced first to the crowd on hand here at Bishop Connolly in Fall River. A four guard set and one forward for both these teams. It starts with Peterson Morrissey, followed by Colin Collins, Kyle Sangster. Parker Rogers, all four guards, and rounded out by forward Neff Carmona. They are coached by Darren Stratton. He is in his 14th season coaching the Knights at Northern Essex. Now for the homestanding bees of Bristol Community College. Again, a four guard, one forward set, starting with Justin Nagaro, followed by Fawaz Mass, Shane Tucker. Excuse me, DK Tucker, followed by Shane DeRosa. And the lone forward, Kevin Newman. The Bees are coached by Rob Delaleo in his sixth season, coaching the Bees here in Fall River. And now the national anthem. The national anthem as played here from Bishop Connolly High School and we are moments away from the opening tap here in this first round match in Region 21 of the NJCAA's Division III Men's Basketball Tournament. Once again, the Bristol Community College Bees at 17 and 10, the Northern Essex Community College Knights, number five. Rounding out the start is real quick for Northern Essex. The visitors, Peterson Morrency, Colin Collins, Cal Sangster, Neff Carmona, and Parker Rogers. For the homestanding Bristol Community College, Justin McElroy, Fowers Mass, Shane DeRosa, DJ Tucker, and Kevin Newby. Once again, we here at Fall River Community Media proud to bring you this NJCAA. Men's basketball tournament here in 2014, and the tip-off is controlled by Morgan Essence. This is 
Morrison. Gets it on the left side for Sangster. He'll fire up a three. Front rim, no good. Rebound pulled down by Bristol and DJ Tuck. He gets it up to DeRozan. Pass to Fawaz Mass. Did not handle it. Goes out of bounds off his hands. Turnover back to Northern Essex. Morrissey. Gets it to come on and then to Sangster. Now he has Collins. Collins to Roger for three. First point of the night to Northern Essex and a turnover. Layup attempt by Morrissey, no good rebound pulled down by Bristol. Home run pass to McElroy. Now on the left side, that was Tucker. Gets it ahead to Mass. Shot no good, rebound pulled down by Essex. Peterson Morrissey, 5'9", freshman out of Miami. Inside pass. To Carmona, no good. Rebound tap around, cleared by Bristol. Getting ahead. Carmona and laying in, checked at DeRozan. First points for the Bees go to DeRozan. 3 2 Northern Essex. Once he bringing up court, gets to Collins on the right side. Now on the left side is the Sangster. Inside pass to Carmona. Shot no good. Rebound taken down this time by Newton. Gets ahead to DeRosa. He'll get it up top to McElroy. Layup no good. Rebound taken down by the Knights. 3 2 Knights over the Bees. Earlier in the first half. Outside pass to Collins. He looks to drive inside. Layup and in. Colin Collins with his first two of the evening. 5-2, Morgan Essex. This is Shane DeRosa. Pass outside to Tucker. That pass outside to DeRosa, the point guard for three. Tied at five. Morrency outside looking for Rogers. Couldn't handle it. Check that, it was last touched by Bristol. The control will remain with Northern Essex. Three minutes into the first half, tied at five in this first round match in Region 21 of the NJCAA's Division Three Men's Basketball Tournament. Outside to Morrissey, we're going back outside to Collins, now on the left side, looking for room inside. Gets it inside to Forbes, he was blocked. And McElroy bringing it up court, another block. Forbes returns to favor, will be called for a foul. Check that, the foul will be on Rogers. Parker Rogers out of Haverhill. Sends Justin McElroy to the line. McElroy, the sophomore out of New Bedford High School. Rims out on the first attempt. Six foot one. Was on a very successful uh, Whaler squad. And made it all the way to the Division I South Section Finals in 2011 in the MIAA. One or two good for McElroy. And standing Bees had the one point lead at 6-5. Inside shot, tough attempt by Sangster. That was no good. On the other end, that is Fawaz Mass, the sophomore, check that freshman out of Taunton. The Tigers here in southeastern Massachusetts, another successful basketball squad that Mass was on. Right, 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 
Back on the other end, inside pass. Great assist from Forbes to Sankster for his first two of the night. Seven six. Knights. McElroy on the outside. He'll get it to DeRozan. DeRozan now inside. This is Newby. Inside pass from Newby to Tucker, who lays it in. 8-7, Bristol. Morency outside for three, Rogers. Two threes for, for Rogers for Northern Essex. And then DeRosa responds with a two. Tied at 10. Outside pass for Rogers. He goes inside, gets it to Forbes. Javante Forbes. Outside pass to. Morrency travels with the ball to over to Bristol Community College. Tied at 10 between the Bees and the Knights here in this first round match in the Region 21 of Division III NJCAA Men's Basketball Tournament here in 2014. Rolls inside to McElroy. It's outside to Mass. Lost control but regained it. Now outside to Tucker. DJ Tucker. Back to DeRosa for three. Check that out. It will be another two. He quickly has nine points. 12-10 Bristol. Foul will be called. In transition. They will simply remain in control with Northern Essex. Rogers for three. So check that, the shot was no good. Looked good from here, but the glass the shot was no good. Rebound, pull down, was taken by uh, Northern Essex, but they lose it out of bounds. Control remains with Bristol. Shane DeRosa, sophomore from Shea High School in Kentucky. Gets it back outside to McElroy. Inside to DeRosa. Foul will be called. On Grant. Ryan Grant checking into the game for Northern Essex. Inside, they have no good. Put back by McElroy, no good. Another offensive rebound, this time handled by Parker. Anthony Parker, freshman, also joining Mass from Taunton. The shot was no good. Pretty layup by Prudis and Morrency for two. Nine to 12. Going with the Jordan style was DJ Tucker. 14-12. Grant lost it for a moment, but regains control and puts it up and in. Timeout called. I believe it was by the Bees, who are tied at 14. Shane DeRosa for our Bristol leads all scores with nine points, followed by Parker Rogers with six for Northern Essex. Bristol, the number four seed with a record of 17 and 10. Northern Essex, number five with a record of 14 and 50. The 
Winner of this match advances to the semifinals of Region 21. Those games will be played on Saturday, March 1st over at Bunker Hill Community College in Boston. Lincoln College of New England and Springfield Tech have already advanced to that semifinal round and get their first round by. Led by Fawaz Mass. 16-14. Inside pass from Grant to Collins and Collins down to the Possession back over to Bristol. Inside pass to McElroy, gets it outside nicely to Parker. Anthony Parker for Bristol. Eighteen fourteen Bristol. Rogers gets it back outside to Ryan Grant. Grant now. Gets out, gets it back to Peterson Morrissey. He'll fire off a three. No good rebound track down by McElroy. McElroy bringing it up for it. He'll get it to Mass. On the inside shot, no good rebound pulled down by Mass and McElroy for a minute. Eventually lost to more than Essex. This is Grant. Three no good. Rebound tracked down by DeRosa for Bristol. Pass up to Mass. Counted and a foul. The Raw's Mass now with four points on the night. The foul will be charged. Yavante Forbes. Three fouls now on Northern Essex as Mass completes the old-fashioned three-point play. Five points for the sophomore freshman on a clock. The seven-point lead for the Bristol Bees at 21-14. In the game now for Northern Essex is Edison Bailey. Control lost to Bristol. It looks like DeRosa stepped out of bounds to control back over to Northern Essex. A low to moderate size crowd in attendance tonight here at Bishop Connolly High School for this opening round of the NJCAA Division III Men's Basketball Tournament. Inside pass to McKellar. Once he bring it up, court for Northern Essex. He will get tripped by McElroy, and that will be his first foul on the night. Check that. The foul will go to Mass. It is his first. Only two fouls for the Bees. Just about halfway through this first half. Seven point lead for the outstanding Bees at Bristol. Another foul called on the inside as Essex looked to drive. That will be called on DJ Tucker. That will be his second. That's going to send Ryan Grant to the line. It's the first. Again, the Bristol Bees recently winning the Massachusetts Community College Athletic Conference's championship by defeating this Northern Essex squad 75 to 60. McElroy lost to Grant with assistance from Morris. Grant will drive up court. Look to get it inside. No shot, but a foul is called. 
That was Nef Kamana with the opportunity. That will be a foul on Derek Pinto. Pinto, the freshman out of Dighton Rehoboth, checking into the game for the first time. And sending Neff Carmona to the line makes one of two. First uh, rebound pulled down by Morgan Essex. And the put back by Grant is good. Two point for Ryan Grant. What was once a seven point lead for Bristol has now dwindled down to a bucket. 21-19, they continue to lead it. Maps to Pinto. Pinto inside to Mikel Roy. Mikel Roy back to Pinto for two and go. Rebound pulled down by Mullins. Once he looked to go on his own, possible travel call there. Gets it outside for three to Sangster, no good. Rebound taken down by Bristol. The Rosa to Mass. Going inside the Rosa, loses it. The man gets to take it up. He makes to put up a shot that is no good, but a foul will be called. On number 15, that is Neff Carmont. His first round. Sends Rosa to the line, one is two, complete. Nine minutes to go in the first half. It is a three point lead for Bristol at 22 19. One is two for the Rosa. Wild shot by Essex. Goes out of bounds. You throw it back over the mass. Uh, Crystal. There's Parker, Anthony Parker from Taunton. He has fourth thus far. The Rosen lead now scores with 10. Kept there by Sangster, no good. Rebound taken down. Looking for Parker, he will get tied up. Possession will remain with Bristol. About eight and a half to go here in the first half. Five point lead now for the Bees, 24-19. Ethan Lopez with you here on Fall River Community Media. Proud to be bringing you coverage of NJCAA. Not quite March Madness. February frenzy there is Anthony Parker for three. Check that out, it will be a two. And he has six. 26-19, back to the largest lead for the Bees at seven. Kick it from outside to in, close to close. Kyle Sankster. Hand check foul called on Sangster. Non-shooting. Troll will simply remain with Bristol. Troy. Back inside to Mass. Shot no good, foul call. It, it will be on Collins, his first. And just like that, Bristol is now in the bonus. It will start with one. And take not quite bonus yet. One more and there will be the one on one time. One of two for Fawaz and Mass. He has six points. 27 21. Six point lead for the B. Make that four. 
layup that time looked like it was from Rogers. He has eight. Taking it to the hoop and not making it was moving. Three point attempt, air ball, and Grant. Mass driving up court, gets it back to his point to roll. Here comes Parker, he slipped out of his hands and out of bounds. Show back over to Northern Essex. Four point lead for Bristol. Grant. No. Rebound pulled down by Bristol. Shot was too high. But he managed to keep it in bounds, does McElroy. Gets it to Parker, who tried to lay it in no good. Blocking foul will be called. Against Sangster. He now has two. So now seven fouls for Northern Essex. On the seven to go here in the first half. Parker runs out on the first attempt. One of two for Parker. He has nine, uh, check that, seven points thus far. Bit of a uh, timekeeping uh, redo, we'll call it. 28 23, Bristol Community leading Northern Essex. Collins, look outside to Sangster. Shot no good, foul will be called. Parker. It's his first. We'll send Sankster to the line. One of two for Sankster. Out of Lawrence, the Northern Essex Knights. With a record of 14 and 15. Carroll shot, no good. Rebound pulled down by Northern Essex. Get ahead to Morrissey. Shot, no good. Rebound pulled down by Mass. Had it ripped out of his hands. Gets it there. Gets it ahead to the Rosa. He'll pull up for two. No good. Rebound taken out by Collins. Twenty-eight, twenty-four. Bristol over Northern Essex. Coming up on six to play in the first half. Rogers for two. Block on the other side as McElroy attempted to go up. Foul will be called on Forbes. That's his second. Eight fouls now for Northern Essex. Five for Bristol. McElroy to the line. One of two for Justin McElroy. against DeRosa, that is his first. 
six fouls now for Bristol. Bad pass taken by McElroy. Good block defensively by Collins. He can head to Sankster and he crashes with the ball. Control the name of Bristol. Throws outside to Max. Throws looking to go inside on his own. Hand check foul called on Northern Essex. That is on Morrissey. Now in the one and one situation is Bristol. The Rosa at the line makes both ends of the one and one. He has 12 points for the Bristol. Bees lead by five, 31-26. Outside shot by Sankster, no good rebound taken by Bristol. Mass will bring it up court, looks to get inside. Shot no good. Rebound tipped around. Eventually it is rebounded again by the Rosa. Good job to keep it in play. Parker now on the other side. Gives it inside to McElroy. Good no look pass. To Brown. This is Kevin Brown, the freshman out of Hope. For his first two. Shot no good for Northern Essex. Rebound and foul. And there is the first foul for, for McElroy. Seven point lead for the Bees now at 33 26. Four and a half to go in the first half. And a foul shot by Neff Carmona rims out. Bristol Bees overall at 17 and 10, Northern Essex at 14 and 15. Here in the first round of region, the Region 21 playoffs in the NJCAA Division III Men's Basketball Tournament. One of two for Carmona. No, rebound, Grant. Porter goes to point lead for Bristol. Foul on the floor. Go on for Waz Mass. That will send Morrissey. First end of the one and one, no good. A bit of different rules uh, between uh, junior college basketball and what you see in high schools, colleges. Don't seem to be taking a one and one until about eight fouls in. Offensive foul. Uh, looks like it's gonna go against McElroy. Two in a row for him now. Thirty-three twenty-eight. Bristol leads it. Again, the winner advances to the semifinals of Region Twenty-One. That will take place this weekend over at Buffalo Community College. The Rosa layup for two. He has himself fourteen points. 
in this first half. In 528, back up to the largest lead of the night for the Bees at seven. Grant for three runs out. Put back by Collins is good. 35-30. That was a two-point attempt by the Rosemont. The rebound pulled down by Brown and fouls Hall. Foul will go against Valent. Kevin Brown to the line. Runs out on the first attempt. Again, the championship game here in Region 21 of NJCAA's Division III, scheduled for Sunday at Bunker Hill Community College in Boston. Grant for Northern Essex, so it looked like he was going to be called for a lane violation. The official had to warn him as Kev Brown went out on both three. Grant taking a strong bid. Rebound tipped around, grabbed by Collins. Before the shot, a beast foul. And that will be. On the on the Rosa, his second. Two forty four to go in the first half. The five point lead for the Bees of Bristol. Colin Collins with one of two. Second attempt, no good, rebound, tip around, pulled down by Brown and Bush. And Bristol calls a timeout with 2.36 to go. It's a four point lead for Bristol at 35 31. Northern Essex Community College, the Knights out of Lawrence, Massachusetts. 14 and 15. These teams met a couple, met twice during the regular season. First time here at Bishop Connolly, the Knights came away with the 106-101 victory. And over in Lawrence, the Bees returned the favor by defeating the Knights 90 to 66. And just a few days ago, Bristol defeating Northern Essex 75-60 in the MCC AC Championship game. So a 2-1 advantage for Bristol in this rivalry this year. The Roses still runs out. Coming up on two to play here in the first half. He got the call for three. Eight points for him as Parker lays it up in. Nine points for Anthony Parker. Thirty-seven, thirty-four, a lead for Bristol. Bad pass picked up by DeRosa. He will work it, shot no good, and he will get fouled on the way to the hoop. One and a half to play. DeRosa will go to the line. Off a bad pass steal from Northern Essex. 
The Knights try to rush the other end of the floor and end up foul. Both teams now over the limit in this first half. As DeRosa makes one of two. Sixteen points for DeRosa in the first half. 39-34 lead for Bristol. Another quick we have a violation of some sort on offense that will turn the ball back over to Bristol. Second foul on Warren, see. Sending DeRosa back to the One or two. 17 points for DeRosa to lead all scorers. Back to a seven point lead for Bristol. 41 34. Clock winding down here in the first half. Grant back outside. This is a two-pointer attempt by getting uh, Bailey. Rebound pulled down by Bristol. About a six-second difference between shot clock and game clock. And we are under 30 seconds. Now ticking down to 20, 14 on the shot clock. Bristol cannot hold it for the last shot. Rosa will have to dive in. He pulls up for two. What a half for Rosa. Grant will get outside to Shankster. And it will count. So Shankster with a three, and after one half, it is a 43-37 lead for Bristol. A very entertaining half of basketball. Seen some great talent from both ends of the floor. Here in this first round match in Region 21 of the NJCAA Division III men's basketball tournament. Back with second half action in a moment here on Fall River Community Media. Back here at Bishop Connolly High School, about to begin second half action here in the first, in the first round matchup of the Division 21 tournament in the MJCAA Division Three men's basketball tournament here in 2014. Number four, Bristol Green, number five, Northern Essex Knights, 43-37. Keaton Lopez with you here on Fall River Community Media. The coverage of this first round matchup in the NBA Doubles, NBA CAA, Region 21 Division III Basketball Tournament. A very entertaining first half of basketball. And it's played very evenly between both teams. Leading BCC in all scorers, Shane DeRosa with 20 points. Followed, followed by, on the Bristol roster, by Anthony Parker with nine. Fawaz Mass with six. And DJ Tucker with four. Also, Justin McElroy and Kevin Brown, excuse me, Kevin Brown with four, and Justin McElroy chipping in with two. Parker Rogers led 
Northern Essex scorers with 10 points. Followed by Kyle Sangster and Colin Collins with eight. Brian Grant with six. Pearson Morrissey with three. Eight. And Neff Carmona with two. Again, 43, 37 lead for the homestanding Bristol Bees in this first round match of the weekend 21 and JCAA Division Three tournament. Six point lead at 43 37. Very physical action early on here in the second of two 20 minute halves. Rebound on the first one, the third down by Northern Essex. Here comes Warrensee driving strong to the hoop. Lost out of bounds by Bristol. Winner of this first round, Rack advances to the semifinals. Those will be played at Bunker Hill Community College this weekend. The Waz Mass on the other end, inside to Kevin Newby, no good. Foul will be called. And that will be on Carmona. And quickly, he gets to a foul, so bring his total up to three. Kevin Newby to the line. Makes one of two. He's coached by Robert DeLeu in his sixth season. And Darren Scratton in his 14th for Northern Essex. Two free throws for Kevin Newby. And did not see who scored that shot for uh, Bristol Community College, but indeed it's a 10 point lead. That shot was scored by DeRosa, and already he is at 22. And it is a 10 point lead for Bristol at 47-37. At Again, Bristol at 17 and 10. They are the champions of the Massachusetts Community College Athletic Conference this year after defeating this very Bunker Hill team 75 to 60. And they have each split victories during the regular season. But Bristol owes a two on advantage for these guys over the Knights. They hope to come away with the victory here in the NJCAA tournament. And get to participate in March Madness. Driving crazy and not getting a hoop to a shot to fall was Morrency. Now he is a very athletic player, it's Morrency. He will go to the line after the foul on McKellar. One of two for Morrissey. He now has four points total. Wins out on the second attempt. Rebound pulled down by Fawaz Mass, the freshman out of Taunton. Got it to DJ Tucker. Now with the point guard, DeRose. Rosa looking to drive inside. Had a three on one. Gets it inside to Kevin, uh, excuse me, Newby. That's right, Kevin Newby. And 
And now he hit, comes off with three points. With four points. Yes. Half. Shot that time by Newby. Rebound pulled down by McElroy on the offensive end. Back outside to Mass. On the other side, that's the Rosa. Two. 51-38 is a 13-point lead for Bristol. Offensive foul off the shot by Rogers. Those are shots again, no good. He has 24 points so far. Layup by Grant, no good. Rebound taken by Valiant. Shot is no good. Foul will be called on Newby. That will be his first. And that will send Valiant to the line. Brings out on the first attempt. One of two for Ederson, Valley. So no good put back by Newby is good. Quickly has six points this first half, the uh, second half. Three-point attempt, no good by Grant. Rebound pulled down by DeRose. He looks to grass down, gets on the outside to Mass. Three on one, blocked. Oh, what a pass from Grant to Rogers. No good, hung up there for a while, in and out. Rebound pulled down by Bristol, here comes Attempted scoop job by DeRosa, no good, but he will get fouled. That foul on Grant. He now has three fouls. That sends DeRosa to a line to add to his ever impressive total this evening. Now with 25 points. Twenty-six is two free throw shots by Shane DeRosa of the sophomore at Shea High School. Two on one trap, eventually he will lose it. McElroy with the scoop layup and in. Northern Essex has no choice but to call a time out. 57-41 is a 16 point lead for the Bees. Again, we're glad you joined us here on Fall River Community Media for coverage of this National Junior College Athletic Association Division III Region 21 first round matchup. For everything Fall River Community Media, you can log on to frmedia.org and also look for us on Facebook and Twitter on our Fall River, on our frmedia.org page. You can see many of these Bristol basketball games on demand, as well as a host of all the other programs we produce here in the Spindle City of Fall River. And also read all about our talented uh, production staff and keep up on everything that we're up to, all the events that we cover around the city of the Fall River, all the different programs that we have to offer. And it's not just television that we do, we do radio as well. You can listen to our 24 hour streaming radio station online. Many of our local residents here in Fall River produce their own programs as well. 
So you find it all at frmedia.org. 16 point lead for Bristol Community College over Northern Essex Community College, 57 41. Another steal. This time it's from DJ Tucker going at it on his own. Hard foul by Collins. And that should be his second. The scoreboard showing it as only his first. Cut it to the line, one or two. He had four points in that first half. One is two for DJ Tucker. 18 point lead for Bristol, 59-41. Grant taking it all on his own, laying it up and in. Ryan Grant had six in that first half. And the other end, Tucker gets back up to the Rosa. Rosa driving inside, pulling up around the rim and in. The Rosa now with 28 points this evening. Sophomore out of Shea High School in Kentucky. Almost parallel with Stanford. Gets it outside to Collins. Three points kept a good rebound pulled down by Parker. Rogers. Gets it back to Kyle Sanford. Now on the other hand, Ryan Grant. Thought about a three. He'll drive inside. Shot no good. Rebound tapped around. Hot potato put up by Collins is good. Colin Collins had eight that first half. Ten overall. Falaz Mass returns the favor. He had six now up to eight. Collins driving hard. Back outside the shanks are three. No good. Rebound ends up in the hands of Rosa. Back on the outside of Kelroy. Rosa back with him. Pull up the three. No. Rebound pulled down by Collins. That's Shanker. Now Collins will take it down court. Charge will be called on DJ Tucker. That's going to be his third. Not in the bonus yet, so will not automatically go to the line yet. Five and a half minutes into the first quarter. Hey, almost a couple, couple of close travel calls there, but ultimately Grant loses it out of bounds, turns over back to Bristol. 63-45, 18-point lead. Another pass of the way. Home court to Anthony Parker. Inside. And stepping with the ball is Kevin Brown. Would have been stuck for offensive foul, so either way, it would to be turned over. Collins. No. Rebound Brown. Gets it up to DeRosa. For two, what a pretty layup. 30 points, Sean Shane DeRosa. Shanks the air ball, rebound Collins. Back inside to Forbes. Shot no good. Rebound pulled on by Kevin Brown. Gets it up to DeRosa. Lost control. Off the, dribbles it off the foot. So it will remain with Bristol. Check that a foul will be called on Rogers. And that will amount to his third. Three for Neff Carmona, Brian Grant, and Parker Rogers for Northern Essex. For Bristol Community. 
three for McElroy and DJ Tucker. Uh, blocking foul will be called on 15. That is Carmada. Now he has four. Quick pass to DJ Tucker, runs out. Rebound pulled down by McElroy. Uh, dribbled off the court. And oh, what some effort by Kevin Brown as he goes colliding into the scorer's table as more than Essex control the ball. Inside pass. Bristol wanted to travel. But it will instead be a foul, sending Neff Carmona to the line. 20 point lead for Bristol at 65-45 in the first round of this NJCAA Division III Region 21 men's basketball tournament. Later rounds will be taking place at Boston's Bunker Hill Community College, Lincoln College of New England and Springfield Technical Community College have already advanced as the one and two seeds respectively. Another foul by the Bees, sending the Knights back to the line. That foul will be against Ryan Pinter. Brian Grant at the line for Northern Essex. He has eight points. Runs out on the first attempt. Definitely this second half, most of the offense has been on the Bristol side of the ball. Whereas we had a pretty evenly contested match in the first half. It seems right now it is all beats. Kelroy, he's at the Pinto. Tucker now. He's guarded by Shankster. The far inside pass. He'll have to go inside on his own. He needs to get rid of it. Gets it outside to his point guard, DeRosa. He's being guided by Grant. Shot clock winding down. He'll look to take it on. He was guarded and blocked by Forbes. And Bristol will lose it out of bounds. Lawaz Mass will check back in for Derek Pinto. Peter said Maroney. Driving inside. Goes to offensive. They will be called. Will be newbie with the block. <laughs> it sends Morrissey to the line. First attempt runs out. Free throw line struggles continue for Northern Essex. Again, 0 for 4 on the last free throw attempt is Northern Essex. The Rosa, the get to Magella, loses. This is Chris Corey in the game for Northern Essex first time tonight. No look pass. And slamming it home, Devontae Bull. And that's going to be, and that's going to be the first two of the night. The Wallace Mass again, back in the game. Back to Melrick Keller on the outside, inside for two. Justin McElroy. Eight points now. Four in the first half, now four so far in the second half. Morrissey driving and swishing to two. That's six thus far. Shot no good, rebound pulled down by Tucker. 
He will get it to Brown, and Coach Rob DeLeo will call a timeout. There's an 18-point lead for his bees at 67-49. Just over halfway through the contest through the second half. Again, all the offense has been with the homestanding Bristol Bees. Shane DeRosa leading all scorers with 30 points thus far. Not much, uh, pretty much not that much of a, uh, a lot of distance between the next leading score with Rogers for uh, Jordan Essex with 10. So far, he's been held scoreless this half. But it seems to be a full team effort for Bristol right now. Even though it's been the DeRosa show, you're seeing all these players contribute. Which is why they are in the lead by 18. Again, the winner will advance further along in this week in 21 and JCAA to be in three men's basketball court. Mass will get it to Newby. Now on the left side, the Rose. Drop block one down, pull for three, wins out, rebound, ends up in the hands of Chester. Back Northern Essex, way we go. Inside to four, no good. Rebound, Maz. The Rosa to tough end, loses it. The pick up by McElroy, puts it up and in. Justin McElroy with six points this second half. 10 points total. Foul will be called on Bristol. And that foul will go against DJ Tucker. He now has four. Four fouls to go along with six points. Again, the free throw line rolls continue. Three-point attempt by Graham Dickerman as a putback by number 30. I guess we'll give that to Newby. The shot is good. Offensive foul. And things continue to fall apart for the Knights of Northern Essex as they now trail by 22. Tough visit to Fall River tonight for the boys from Lawrence. Halfway through this second half, and it's time to go on the podcast. Underneath pass to Fawaz Mass. Ten points for him this season. Yeah, a decent turnout tonight here at Bishop Conway High School. As Northern Essex is here again. Fisherman, back outside to Mass. Seventy-three forty-nine, Bristol. Nine to go in the contest. Here 
Bristol and DeRosa taking their time here. Oh, what a pretty, pretty heavy shoulder fake. Misses the shot and he will get fouled. Bristol head coach uh, Rob DeLay will hope to fill the gym up with Bristol students, faculty, fans, and members of the Fall River community. Staying that's important for the community to come out and support these student athletes here at Bristol Community College, especially during this uh, incredible run and some great basketball, college level basketball here in the city of Fall River. Thirty-two points for Shane DeRosa. As Bristol continues to add to its lead, another steal, another layup by DeRosa. Thirty-four points off a great assist by the Laws Mass. Is a twenty-eight point lead for the Bristol Bees at seventy-seven forty-nine. Ethan Lopez with you here on Fall River Community Media. Our, our producer director tonight, Adam Kitchen, assisted by Evan Manchester. Here tonight at Bishop Connolly High School, bringing you this first round match in the NJCAA Division Three Region 21 tournament. And as you can see, Coach Darren Stratton just beside himself with this team. Could not understand what's going on. Preaching defense. Not pleased with his team trailing by 28. Meanwhile, Bristol looking to take things easy. Still keep the flow going, keep it under control. Thirty-four points for Shane DeRosa, the sophomore out of Shea High School in Kentucky. Falling right behind him, sophomore out of New Bedford, Justin McElroy, ten. Kevin Newby coming alive in this second half with eight. Again, another turnover on offense by Northern Essex. Driving to the hoop, Fisherman. About a three on one there. Shot was no good, but it goes out of bounds off of the left hands of well, the aspects that time off the hands of Mikel Roy and Bush. 28 point lead for Bristol here at Bishop Conley, 7 7 49. Brian Grant, three, no good. Rebound, tap around, pulled down by Mass. Over passes to Rosa, almost tipped out of bounds, gets it to McElroy. On the other end, Mass, two wins out. Rebound pulled down by Newby. He'll get it back outside to Mass. Rosa asks for it so he can set up the offense once again. This is Graham Gisherman, sophomore out of Dartmouth. That's McElroy. Now the Rosa inside Newby. He's being guarded by Force. Gisherman. Gets it inside to Newby. Two on one. Inside to McElroy, but blocked by Forbes. He'll get fouled. Into the game for Northern Essex. This is Justin Getman. It seems to all be falling apart for Northern Essex right now. As Bristol just continues to add to its lead. Justin McElroy at the line, one of two, he now has 11 points. Yeah. 
Two free throws for Justin McElroy, the sophomore on the Bedford. 30 point lead for the Bees over the Knights. This is Parker Rogers. He leads all scorers thus far for Northern Essex with 10. Again, on that other end, that's a weak side for them. They lose it again as DeRosa drives up and gets fouled. That right side for Northern Essex seems to not be working for them. And Staten will call another timeout for Northern Essex as we see uh, Rob DeLeu and Michael Ford uh, trying to improve Gisherman's game. And got to control silly mistakes. That not have a lot to be complaining about. It's a 30 point lead with seven minutes to go in the contest. Thirty-five points now for Shane DeRosa, who is at the line. With the thirty-six. Thirty-two point lead for Bristol. Eighty-one forty-nine. Trying to do some right back into Northern Essex off the bank, Alec Pachika. His first trail of the night. Parker Rogers, the leading scorer for Rogers, uh, excuse me, Northern Essex fouled out as Newby gets it to go. Ten points for him. Two-point attempt. Again, that's by Pacheco. So five foot points for Kevin Pacheco off the out Pacheco off the bench for Northern Essex. The Rose already attempt again, no good. 28 point lead. Still by the Rosa. The poor passing by Northern Essex seems to be their Achilles heel the second half. An evenly matched first half has now gone by the wayside. For two. Twelve points for Kevin Newby this second half alone. Lay up inside by Ryan Grant, no good for Northern Essex. Back to the 30-point lead for Bristol. Five to go in the contest. Gisherman thinks about it. Gets it back to the rover. Three-point Gisherman on the right side. Sophomore out of Dartmouth, Graham Disherman. His first point for the night is a tray. 88-55. With the laser. Another bad pass taken right out of him. Oh, no look pass from DeRosa to Newby. 14 points. Kevin Newton is now a 35-point lead for the Bees, 90 to 55 over the Knights of Northern Essex, located in Lawrence. We're here at Bristol, uh, Fort Bristol Community College at Bishop Carnegie here in Fall River. Cannot complete the three-point play, but he'll put it back. At 16 points. Kevin Newby might give Shane DeRosa a run for his money as the leading scorer tonight. Can he do it in four minutes? Anything's possible. But how about the play of Al Pacheco? Another three-point attempt, no good. He came out right off the bench with five. 37-point lead 
for Bristol, 92-55. Four to go in the contest. Oh, will be lost out of bounds. Off the pass from Derek Pinto. Again, Northern Africa's leading scorer, Parker Rogers with 10 has fouled out. You got Colin Collins back in also with 10. Uh, try to become the lead scorer for North Essex. Can't get it that time. Rebound tapped around, stolen, and eventually lost out of bounds. By Bristol. Turn back over to Northern Essex. Morrison. Inside for two, that's Carmona. Neff Carmona. Shot blocked off of uh, hit down the other end. Pachico comes and gets it in. Seven points off the bank for Alec Pachico for the Knights. So 92-59 lead for Bristol. Clock continues to wind down. Under three now to go. Off the bench now, this is Mike Fiola, freshman out of, Di out of Diamond. DJ Tucker wins out, but eventually they get his own lead. Two and a half to go. What else can you say for Shane DeRozan? 39 points. Off the top of the backboard, automatic turnover to <laughs> Bristol as as Shane DeRosa will come will come off the court. Thirty nine points tonight for the sophomore out of Shea High School in Kentucky. Under two to play now. It is a 34 point lead for the Bees. 95 61. Shot blocked out of bounds by. Pinto. She go with another three point attempt, no good. Rebound tracked down by DJ Tucker. So Bristol will advance to the next round at Bunker Hill Community College. The semifinals at the Legion 21, NJCAA. And Kent Mike Fiola gets into the scoring column. The freshman out of Diamond here in the Spindle City. And continuing to lay it on. Now a 38 point lead. That's what Derek Pinto. And with that, almost every Bristol player has gone into the scoring book, I believe. So we're all players contributing tonight. This is gonna be a solid victory tonight here at Bishop Connolly for the Bristol Community College Bees in the first round of the NJCAA Division III Region 21 Men's Basketball Tournament here in the year 2014. Great things happening here in the city of Fall River as Colin Collins pulled up a three, no good. Rebound off the hands of Pinto and will remain with Northern Essex. At the Chico air ball, Bristol will let that fall out of bounds. 99-61.
38 point lead for Bristol. 39 of those 99 points belonging to Shane DeRosa. Right behind him, we got 16 for Kevin Newby all in the second half. And with that, Bristol will hold it for the last shot before Morency, Peterson Morency for Northern Essex. Files in and will send them to the line. To try to make this an even 40 point victory. And with that, the Waz Masses foul shot that goes in gets them into double digits, triple digits at 100. Two free throws and it is so is a 40 point lead with 15 seconds to go. A desperation three by Collins wins out. Bristol will hold on to the final shot. They will play Pocketator, keep away. And tonight, the Bristol Bees come away with the 40-point victory over the Northern Essex Knights, 101 to 61, the final score. Shane DeRosa leading all scores with 39 points. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, and coming off the bench here in the second half, Kevin Newby with 16. Leading scorers for the Knights. It was Parker Rogers with 10 in the first half, and followed by Colin Collins with eight in the first half, followed by two here in this second half to tie in with 10. The Bees move on here in Region 21 of the NJCAA Division III Men's Basketball Tournament in the year 2014. And move on to the semifinals at Bunker Hill Community College. I'm Ethan Lopez for Adam Kitchen and Evan Manchester. We thank you for joining us tonight here on Fall River Community Media for Bristol Community College Men's Basketball. Good night. <laughs>